Hey everybody, I'm Bobby D and this is the Average Joe Hot Rod Show. That is right, we are back in business, baby. It's been a couple months since you've seen my ugly mug on your screens, but here I am. You may have noticed that a couple months back we had a bit of a breezy day in Iowa and it resulted in about a billion dollars worth of damage. Unfortunately, I was right in the middle of that and the hacienda here took a hard hit. You may also notice from the sound of my voice that I am under the weather a bit. That's right, I caught that thing that's in the news that everyone is trying not to catch. <laughs> Coronavirus! But I'm not letting the fact that my lungs are on fire distract me from noticing that you have continued to support this channel while I have been gone. We are rapidly approaching the 750 subscriber mark, and you know what that means? It's time for another giveaway. So stay tuned and find out how you can win some awesome stuff from Tecton Tools. Okay, everybody, how about I just unbox what we've got to give away so you can see what you can win. Let's get out my handy-dandy Milwaukee pocket knife and cut into this bad boy. Let's see. set of ratchets from Tecton. We have a 3 8 ratchet, a quarter inch, and a half inch. So what can you win here? Well, we have a three piece set of ratchets. We have a half inch, we have a 3 8 and we have a 1 quarter. Now, these are our Tecton's composite series of wrenches. Now, hold on. I know what some of you are saying behind your computer screens. You're saying, hey, composite equals plastic. Why would I want a plastic ratchet? They're just going to break and bend. Okay. These are not completely plastic. These are a traditional metal ratchet that has been encased in a polymer. Why would you do that? Okay, well, there's some benefits to doing this. Number one, have you ever had to work on something in the extreme cold and had to take your gloves off? If you've ever had to wrench in a cold garage in a northern climate without a glove on in winter, you know what I'm talking about. Well, this material will be much more friendly on your hands than a plain chromed ratchet. So there's one benefit. Number two, have you heard of a non-marring hammer? Well, what are they usually made out of? That's right, some sort of nylon or other polymer. That's another good reason to have a set of these laying around your garage. If you ever work on something that's pretty fancy, what happens if you drop a ratchet or it slips? A chromed steel ratchet could chip paint, could chip chrome, it can mar finishes. Well, this material, much like a non-marring hammer with a nylon tip, will cause less or no damage to that finish. So there's practical reasons to have these. Tecton advertises these ratchets as having a 72 tooth gear mechanism. And I will confirm that they are quite smooth. Can you hear that? very smooth. The lever switch over is very smooth. These are a quality ratchet. If you're interested in winning these, well, how do you do it? Well, let me tell you. So you've decided that you want to be the person that wins the three ratchet set from Tecton Tools. That's great. How do you do it? Number one, you have to subscribe to the channel on YouTube. If you're watching this on YouTube right now and you haven't done so, go down below, click on the subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the little bell notification so you never miss any of our quality content. If you're watching this on Facebook, I will put a link to the YouTube channel above. Number two, 
This one's important, okay? So if you're on Facebook right now watching, stop. Click on the link above and head over to YouTube. We will all wait for you over there. I promise. <clears throat> okay. I'm gonna assume everybody who was over on Facebook is now with us on YouTube. Awesome. Step number two to win. Leave a comment down below in the comment section. Now I want you to tell me in that comment what you're going to work on with these ratchets if you win. That's it, okay? One month after we reach 750, I'm going to stop the entries. So you have plenty of time because I think right now we're sitting around 7, 17, 7, 7, yeah, 7, 17, 7, 18, okay? So there's plenty of time to hop on to win these, all right? Oh, and before I go, there is a third thing I would really love for you to do for me. It won't help you win, but Bobby D would consider it a, a personal favor. And here's what it is, ladies and gentlemen. If you think of anybody in your life that might enjoy this channel, or heck, could even maybe enjoy those wrenches over there, send them a link. Help them enter. Help them find some entertainment. Because 2020 has been hard. And I have a feeling it's gonna keep being hard. So we all need a little entertainment. We all need a few favors. Uh, and let me tell you, sharing is caring and Bobby D needs a little more caring in his life. So if you could do that for me, I would greatly appreciate it. And I really appreciate the fact that because of this year, I have not been able to do what I love doing. And that is showcasing awesome rides built by everyday average people. I hope in 2021 we can get back to that because you seem to love that the most and I love doing that the most. So thank you for sticking with me and not leaving me. And heck, we've actually been growing instead of holding steady or shrinking. So that is awesome, that is amazing. That has really gotten me through some really tough days knowing that people are enjoying what I'm doing and continuing to support it, even though I've had to just kind of go off on tangents and do all kinds of weird stuff. So thank you so much. Massive love from me to all of you out there in the audience. Oh, and for the next video, everyone keeps asking me about the Monte Carlo in the garage. We're gonna dig it out and we're gonna dust it off. Hopefully it'll start. We'll get it out and I'll show you the Monte Carlo that's in the garage. Tell you a little bit about its story and what I hope to do with it if life gets back to normal and maybe actually gets a little bit better, okay? So that'll be our next video, probably. Um, I just need to wait for one more warm day to dig it out and clean it out and clean it off. Okay? All right. So, good luck, everybody. This is Bobby D with the Average Joe Hot Rod Show signing off saying, remember, kick butt, take names. But most importantly in 2020, just kill with kindness. We'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.